Huh? Okay? So now let us look at uh, materials and energy under electricity. Okay? A topic under materials and energy, which is electricity. Are we together? Yes. So first we are going to look at uh, 2016 paper, paper 2 as the first example. Okay? So it's saying uh, carefully study the electric circuit diagram below. Okay? So they want us to study this uh, electric circuit given. Okay? So this electric circuit has got a battery. This one is a battery. Are we together? So this is our battery. Then we have got our ammeter. So this is our ammeter. So an ammeter is an instrument which measures what? Electric current. So this is current, people. Yes. This 2.0 amps. This is current. So this is our current. Take note. This is the current. Okay? This is our current. Okay? So our current is what? Uh, 2.0 amps, okay? So this is our ammeter, ammeter rating, 2.0 amps. So this is our what? electric current, okay? Then you have got a switch. This one is a closed switch, okay? This switch has been closed. Then you have got our voltmeter. So remember, what is a voltmeter? A voltmeter is simply an instrument used to measure voltage. So in our case, our voltage has been given to be what? 8 volts. Aye. Yes. So 8 volts, that's our voltage. Voltage 8 volts. Are we together, people? Yes. yes. Then it, this circuit has got uh, three resistors. Resistor 1, resistor 2, and resistor what? 3. So resistor 1, it's 1 ohm. Okay? Yes. Then it, resistor 2 has not been given. And then resistor 3, which is R3, it's 2 what? ohms. Okay? So this is uh, our circuit diagram with this information. Are we together? Yes. Then question number 1. We are taught to say, for saying, hey, sorry, how many cells are in the battery? How many cells are in the battery? So they want us to identify or to count the number of cells in this battery. Are we together? Yes. So, uh, this long pole represents uh, a positive. This one is positive, right? Yes. Then this one is a negative. So, meaning a tall one and uh, this short one becomes, gives us a what? Gives us one cell. So, this one is a what? It's a cell. This one is negative, this one is what? Positive. So counting uh, cells, you count a tall one and a short one to be one. So this, this one is a single cell. Are we together? Yes. So in our case, counting the number of cells, I'm going to say positive, negative, one. Positive, negative, two. Positive, negative, three. three. Positive, negative, four. four. So this battery, it has how many cells before? Four, four cells. So solutions are right from this side. So solutions or answers, are we together? Yes. Solutions A. They are saying how many cells are in the battery. So they are saying how many cells? Four cells. So this is our first answer. You can look at question B. Then question B they are saying uh, how are the three resistors connected? How are the three resistors connected? So R1, R2 and R3. They are saying what type of connection is this one? So remember under this electricity, we usually talk about uh, two types of connection, right? Yes. We have two types of connection. We have what we call parallel connection, which looks like this, parallel, parallel, parallel connection, okay? Which looks like, let's say, if three resistors are connected in parallel, they are going to appear like this, okay? Or well, let's say twine, two resistors are connected in parallel, they are going to be like this. Are we together? Yes. If there are three, I will have another on this side. Yes. This is what you call it. Parallel what? Connection. This is parallel what? Connection. Are we together? Yes. So whenever I come across this type of connection, this one is called what? Parallel connection. And then this one is called what? Series. This is what? Series. This is it. Series. This is what? Parallel. So this is our R1, R2, R1, 3. Okay? Now in our case, this is a series connection. Connection. So they're saying, uh, how are the three resistors connected? They are in series. Okay? So we just say series. Okay? Series connection. Are we together? Yeah. Then we can look at question C, which is saying, uh, question C is saying what? Calculate the resistance of resistor 2. Indeed, resistor 2, you've not been given line. R2, we don't have R2. Right? We've not been given R2, right? Yes. Yeah. So we need to find R2. How do we do that? Yes. We need to find what? R2. Or resistor what? 2. Okay? Now, since we have been given uh, the, the, the current, 
and we have the what? The voltage. Okay? It's going to be easy to find the what? To find the missing what resistor. I and resistance for the missing resistor, which is R at Y. Yes. So I'm going to say, we can use this formula and say, we know that current, take note of uh, this formula. And so I have to use this box, very important, okay? This one, where well, this is voltage, this is current, and this is what? Resistance sign, okay? So I have got over or division sign, then I have got multiplication sign here. Yeah. Are we moving together, people? Yes. yes. So for us to find current, we say, we cover where current is, I. So it's the current, current is equal to what? Voltage over resistance. That is if you want current line. Yes. Then if we want uh, resistance, you cover R line. So we're going to have R is equal to V, which is voltage over current. current. If you want the formula for voltage, you say you cover where V is line. Yes. Then you say current times what? Resistance. So voltage is equal to current times what? Resi resistance according to this line. Okay? Now in this case, you can use any of these. Are we together? Yes. So let us use uh, maybe this one line. You say our current is equal to voltage over resistance total. Are we together? Yes. Okay? Now in our case, people, we have the current. Aye. We have the what? Yes. The current, which is what? 2.0. We also have the voltage, which is what? 8. Are we together? Yes. Then we don't have the total resistance. Are we together? Okay? So I'm going to say current is equal to voltage over. Now the resistance total we don't have. So how do you find the resistance total? You say you just add. Since the three resistors, R1, R2, and R3, they are in what? Series. You just add. You find the sum of these three. And say R1 plus R2 plus R3. Are we together? Yes. Then we substitute. What is our current? Our current is what? Two. So where we have current, you put what? Two. Equals voltage is what? Eight. Are we together? Yes. So we have eight. Are we moving together, people? Yes. yes. Over R1. Now R1 we have it's what? It's one. R1 is what? One plus. R2 we don't have mine. So just maintain R2. Are we together? Plus. Do we have R3? Do we have R3? Yes, it's what? Two. Okay? It's the two. Are we moving together? Let me write from this side. Can I write from this side? So I'm going to write from this side. Right? Okay? So where are we? We are here. We are saying we have got two. Okay, I can move on and say two is equal to eight. Are we together? Over one plus two is what? Three. We can add these are like them, right? So one plus two is what? You get three plus R2A, R2. These are not, are not what like them. We can multiply them, but you cannot add them. Right? So you cannot add R3, sorry, three plus R2, you cannot add design. Yes. So we are going to say what? In this case, we want to make R2 the subject of the form, formula. So what I'm going to do is say over one. Then you close multiply. Yes. So here what you're going to do is you're going to multiply uh, two multiplied by three plus R2, two. very good. Equals one times eight, eh? it's what? Eight. You get eight. Are we together, people? Yes. Then you say, you can now remove the brackets, eh? yes. so it's a two times three, you get six. Plus two times R2, you get two R2. Equals eight. Are we together, people? Yes. So at this level, we're going to do what? Correct like this. So we're going to remain with a two R2 to this side. is equal to eight. When you transpose this uh, positive on the other side, you're going to have what? Negative minus what? Six. Then you're going to have two R2 two is equal to eight minus six. You get what? Two. You get two. Are we together? Yes. For us to remain with R2, divide both sides by the coefficient of R2, which is what? Two. So it's over two, over two. So these two are going to go. R2 is therefore equal to what? Two into two is what? One ohm. So this is our answer. Are we together, guys? R2 is equal to what? One ohm. That's the resistance. Are we together? Okay? We can move on and look at question D. We have question D here. Which is saying, calculate the total resistance. Are we together? Calculate the total resistance. So that is question D. So question D, I'll answer it from this side, okay? 
So uh, they want the total resistance. So we say uh, resistance total is equal to now since the three resistance are in series, you just add the mine. You just add the three resistors and say R1 plus R2 plus R3. Are we together? So what is our R1 people? It's 1. R1 is 1 ohm. Are we together? Plus R2, it's also 1, 1 ohm. Plus R3, it's 2, 2 ohms. Very good. When you add 1 ohm plus 1 ohm plus 2 ohms, you get what? 4 ohms as our resistance to total. So our answer is 4 what? 4 ohms. That's our total what? resistance. How to Yes. So this one will die nine. Okay? Plus then, plus uh, the next one, yes? Okay? Let us move on. Just a minute. So now, let us look at question E. Calculate the total voltage. The total what? Voltage. Are we together? So now, Calculating the total voltage, we are going to say, which is question E, we know the formula for voltage is what? I. Voltage is equal to current times resistance. Are we together? So it says, voltage is equal to current multiplied by what? The resistance. Total in this case, I. Since we want the total voltage. Okay? So it says, voltage is equal to what is our current? Our current has been given to be what? 2 I. So it just says, 2 multiplied by what is our resistance? 4. This is our n. So multiplied by what? By 4. How it other people? Yes. Voltage is equal to uh, 2 times uh, 4 is what? It's 8. 8. 8 what? 8 volts. In fact, this one has been given 9. Right? This one has been given to be what? To be? To be 8. We have our voltage. Why are we getting voltage? Aye. So I just decided to put this question delivery here yeah? to show you how to get what? Voltage. Okay? We will be proven to say the voltage is indeed what? 8. Are we together? Yes. Okay? Anyway, we can move on. Then question uh, F, it's saying if the cells on the battery are of equal voltage, calculate the voltage for a single cell. So meaning if these cells in this battery, they consist of equal voltage, the voltage for this cell is equal to the voltage for this cell, for this cell and for this cell they are the same. What is the voltage for a single cell? For one cell? Are we together? Yes. So in this case, we just say, this question F, question F, we just say question F. Since we have how many cells do we have in the battery? On a battery. How many are they? Four. They are four cells. How many? Four, four cells. cells. So it says, four cells is equal to what? The total voltage, which is what? 80 volts. I Yes. Four cells are shared in what? A, a total voltage of 8 volts. What about one cell? Hi. So I say, one cell is equal to X. You don't know this one, right? This is what you want. So these are going to go. Then we can cross multiply. And say, 4 times X, you get what? 4X Four Four X is equal to 1 times 8 volts. You get 8 what? 8 volts. Then now, for us to remain with our X, divide both sides by what? 4. This side by what? Four. four. So these two are going to go. X is equal to uh, four into uh, eight. You get what? Two. You get two volts. Then you say therefore one cell is equal to what? Two volts as our answer. Are we together, people? So I mean, each cell has got two volts. Let us try to prove. So I say this cell two, this cell two, this cell two, this cell two. Aye. Yes. And this should give us a total sum of what? 8 volts together. So, 2 plus 2, 4. Plus 2, 6. Plus 2, 8 volts. You have my Okay? Then we can look at our question G, this one. It said, uh, if resistor 3, which is R3, is removed, okay? If R3 is removed, okay? If we remove this resistor 3, we remove this one, right? If this one is what? Removed, okay? If, and we know that R, R, R2 is what? It's 1 ohm as well. Yes. R2 is 1 ohm. This one, R2 is 1 ohm. Now they are saying if we remove this R3 and the circuit with the remaining resistors, which are R1 and R2, okay? So if we remove R3, we are going to remain with what? R1 and R2. That's what they are saying, right? Yes. Okay? And the circuit 
with the remaining resistance R1 and R2 is completed by closing the switch. Okay? Yes. So, what will be the reading of the ammeter? So, if we remove R3, if we remove this R3, what would be the reading of the what? The ammeter. So, you know, this ammeter is an instrument which measures what? Current. Okay? So, if you are being asked to calculate, sorry, uh, to find the reading of the ammeter, they are simply uh, talking about what? Current. Because the ammeter measures what? Current. Okay? So, in the direct, they are asking for us to calculate the what? The current. Because this ammeter, it reads what? Current. So, in this case, they are asking for us to calculate the what? The current. Okay? That is, if we remove what? R3. What would be the current? Are we together? Yes. So, that is our question, what, people? Question, is it G? G. G, very good. So, question G, they are simply asking us to find the current. So, you know current, guys? Current, current is equal to voltage over resistance. Right? Yes. This is our formula we are going to use. This formula, right? So, this is what we are going to use. So, we are going to say current is equal to what? Voltage over resistance. Are we together? Okay? Then you say now, current is equal to voltage, you maintain our voltage over. Now, resistance, in this case, we want to get this uh, for ohms. I because this one has been removed. This one has been what? Removed. We cannot get this one, I This four. So we are going to say, for us to find the, the total resistance, you say, R1 plus R2. These are the only ones which are the nine. Yes. Then you say current is equal to what is the voltage? Voltage is what? 8. Over R1 is what, people? 1. Plus R2 is what? 1. Are we together? Yes. Current is equal to 8 over 1 plus 1? 